Links are in the description. Come over here to Google, type in Visual Studio 2013. Click the Visual Studio Older Downloads link. You need to have a, both a Microsoft account as well as a free Dev Essentials program account. The free Dev Essentials program is, as the name states, free. So you get access to a bunch of tools, which includes these older versions of Visual Studio. Once you are signed up for that, come back here, click the 2013 arrow, click download. Locate Visual Studio Community 2013 with update five. It'll say DVD, that is okay, that's what we want. Click download. I already have a copy downloaded onto my desktop here. I'm then going to right click it and I'm going to open with 7-zip and I'm going to highlight everything, click extract and I'm going to type in ES underscore ISO. Close that window, open up the new folder. I'm going to double click the vs underscore community dot exe. I'm going to just leave it on the default install location. I'm going to check mark I agree. I'm going to uncheck the join Visual Studio Experience Improvement Program. Um, don't need that. Keep that. Don't need that. And then I'm going to click install. Click yes on like the little pop-up that shows up on your monitor. So once you're done, it's gonna say this. Click launch. There we go. All right, so it's gonna ask us to sign in. You will eventually probably need to do this. I'm gonna say not now, maybe later. Like dark, newer ver versions of Visual Studio pretty much require you to do this. Um, development settings, stick to general. Pick your theme of your choice. Click start. And there you have it, Visual Studio 2013 with Update 5 is installed and ready to go.